Hello friends, greetings from the Tagoreans. Two months back, on 20th of May 2020, West Bengal, Odisha and Bangladesh were devastated by Cyclone Amphan, the worst cyclone to hit that part of the world in over 200 years. Over half a million of the most vulnerable people in society became homeless with incalculable damage to the environment and ecology of the area and to lives and livelihoods. The aftermath posed an insurmountable challenge for people who had already lost so much as a result of the lockdown imposed by COVID-19. We salute the resilience of all of those struggling to rebuild their lives under extremely difficult conditions. Watching this horror unfold in front of our eyes and in keeping with our philanthropic ethos as a charitable organization, our chairperson, Mrs. Monisha Smith, and the entire executive committee of the Tagorians immediately decided to embark upon a fundraising campaign. As the oldest Bengali cultural organization in the UK, we felt it was our moral obligation to provide financial assistance and aid, however humble, however limited, to stand in solidarity with all those affected. We pledged 100% of our membership subscriptions for this year, and with the overwhelming response from our members, patrons, friends and well-wishers, and their large-hearted generosity, we were able to raise a significant sum. Thanks to all of you who have stood united with us, helping us accomplish so much more collectively than we could have done as individuals. The fund of over £4,000 raised by the Tagorians has been distributed in its entirety and equally between our two chosen charities, Calcutta Rescue Fund and Simi Child in Need Institute both engaged in essential reconstruction and rebuilding work with some of the most vulnerable and severely affected people of the region. We were keen to express our gratitude to all our members, patrons and donors through an online presentation. And this allowed us to reflect back on our first foray in the online performance space on the occasion of Robindra Jayanti in May this year, which was seen by a staggering 75,000 viewers across the world. We were overwhelmed with the positive response, having received numerous unsolicited messages of appreciation and congratulations for what clearly was a challenging and ambitious venture to conceive, record, edit and present. So, we thought, why not play back that same production in memory of all those who have lost so much either due to COVID-19 or Amphan, bearing with it a message of solidarity, hope and positivity. This time, the presentation has been enhanced with our acknowledgement to the many patrons and donors for their generosity with key messages from the two charities in India supported by the Tagoreans, Sini and Calcutta Rescue Fund. And finally, with some spontaneous outpourings of love and appreciation that we received for this presentation in May this year. In July, normally we would have been gearing up for our annual stage show at Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan, London. Sadly, that is no longer possible at the moment because of COVID-19. But we are delighted that by relaunching our first online musical presentation on social media, we will once again be able to connect with many thousands to reach out once again, not just to audiences in London, but to the entire world, the Bishobhara Pran, world full of vibrant life.
Welcome to Bisho Bhara Pran, the world full of vibrant life, a digital presentation by the Tagoreans UK to celebrate Robindra Jayanti, the 159th birth anniversary of Nobel laureate Kobi Guru Robindranath Tagore. Given the global crisis brought about by the coronavirus pandemic, we find ourselves in a strange, unfamiliar new world of social distancing which can be isolating, distressing, even terrifying for many. All of the amazing work that you will see in the course of this presentation has been conceptualized, created and compiled during the lockdown period by a group of individuals who have enthusiastically worked together on this labor of love to offer hope and positivity through a sense of community support, teamwork and bonding so critical in times of crisis. Hopefully Tagore's inspirational creative works presented by a team of performers will help us connect with a sense of community that has been missing in our lives ever since the pandemic has taken over. After all, we need to be in isolation, but we don't need to be isolated. We have chosen to dedicate Bishobhara Pran as a tribute to the hundreds of thousands of people who have tragically succumbed to this pandemic across the world, some of whom, sadly, are personally known to us. We honor their lives and pray for their souls, while our thoughts and prayers are with their grieving families and friends. We also offer this presentation as a tribute to the thousands of brave healthcare and social care practitioners across the globe who are constantly and selflessly battling this deadly virus in order to protect lives and save humanity. The first song that we have chosen to present is a devotional hymn composed in Rag Iman Kalyan. Included in Tagore's Nobel Prize winning anthology of poems, Gitanjali, this song was written in 1910. Tagore asks the question, Since when have I been singing your songs? Since when have I been yearning to see you? Well, it seems as if forever. Like the waterfall that gushes out, not knowing where she heads, so too does my soul burst out in the flow of life. Like the flower that patiently stays up all night for the first rays of light, so too does my heart wait in eternal hope for your presence for as long as I can remember. Since time immemorial. Oh, he. 
जाने नाशे कहारे जाए cultural organization in the UK founded in 1965 by cultural enthusiasts Papun Gupto and Goirika Gupto Over the last 55 years the Tagoreans have been involved in producing pioneering and innovative musical artistic cultural social and educational initiatives in the UK across continental Europe and in various cities in India Interestingly The music tracks accompanying all our songs in this presentation had been commissioned for the Tagoreans in early 2000 by the renowned Tagore music exponent Maya Shen, our chief patron and a major guiding force for the Tagoreans over the years. I'm not sure that she or indeed anyone else at the time could ever have imagined that these tracks would become so valuable at a time like this when we are unable to record a song with live musical accompaniment the next song that we will present is an ode to creation embodied in all of nature and the primeval instinctive unexplained thrill we experience when we consider the magnificence of the universe and our own place within it a message that is particularly relevant during these present times when we are faced with a global pandemic of an unprecedented scale these are not the times to despair but to strengthen our faith in nature in humanity and in the almighty written in 1924 When Tego was 63 years old the poet says suns and stars fill the sky the world is full of vibrant life 
I have found my place amongst them all. And that is why I am awestruck and my song fills the world. I listen, I look in wonder and awe. My life becomes one with the pulsing heart of the universe. I find the unknown among the familiar. And that is why I am awestruck and my song fills the world.
We next present one of Tagore's most famous poetic compositions, The Awakening of the Waterfall, where he likened the flow of a mountain stream to the flow of human life. This poem marks a turning point in Tagore's own journey of awakening and self-realisation and provides much needed inspiration to those entrapped and shackled in their daily lives, as many of us may be experiencing during this pandemic and its resultant impositions on society. Many years later, Tagore reflected on this moment. One day, when I was 18, when I stood watching, at early dawn, the sun sending out its rays from behind the trees, I suddenly felt as if some ancient mist had in a moment lifted from my sight. And the morning light in the face of the world revealed an inner radiance of joy. That which was memorable in this experience was its human message, the sudden expansion of my consciousness. I wrote this poem on the first day of my surprise. The soundtrack that you can hear is an extract from Rag Gitanjali based on Malkosh and Rageshri on the Sur Bahar by renowned maestro Imrat Khan, specially composed for the Tagore Festival, a month-long music and cultural festival across the UK in 1986 to commemorate Tagore's 125th birth anniversary, curated by the Tagoreans. Ajiye prabhati rubir kaur, kemone poshilo praneer paur, kemone poshilo guha raghare, prabhat pakhir gaan, na jani kenore, eto deen pare, jagi out hilo praan. This morning, the rays of the sun struck at the roots of my being. Oh, how! The song of the morning bird entered into this darksome cave. Oh, how! I know not how it happened, but my life awoke from its sleep. My life has awakened from its sleep, and the waters surge and swell. Oh, the desire of life and its surge! Cannot hold back. Jagiya uti che pran, ure uthali uti che bari, ure prani re basho na prani rabi, ruthi arakhi te nari. Aruthar kori kapi che kuthar, shira rashi rashi puri che khushi. Bhuliya bhuliya phenil sholil, goroji uti che darun roshi. Hethai hothai pagole re prai. गुरिया गुरिया माकिया बैडा बाहिर ते चाय देखी ते ना पाए कुथा है कारार दार क्यानो रे पिठा ता पाशान है नू चानी दी के तर बाधोन क्यान भांगरे विदाए भांगरे बाधोन शाधरे आजी के प्रानेर शाधोन लहोरीर पर लहोरी तुलिया आखातेर पर आ किशेर आधार किशेर पाशान उधुली जखोन उठे चे बाशोना जगोते तखोन किशेर डार The earth, how it trembles and shakes The pebbles hurtle and fall And surging and swaying of the foaming waves Roar and rumble with relentless rage Why? Why is God so cruel? Why all around this bondage? Ami thali bo kuru na thara, ami phami bo pashan kara, ami chagot plabiya bada bo gahiya, akul pagol para. 
के शालाईया फूल कुड़ाईया राम धनु आका पाखा उड़ाईया रोबीर किरणे हाशी छड़ाईया दिवरी बड़ा निखाली शिखार होई ते शिखारे छुटी बो भुधार होई ते भुधारे लुटी बो हिशे खालो खाल गे कालो काल ताले ताले दिवो ताली ऐतो कथा अच्छे ऐतो गान अच्छे ऐतो प्राण अच्छे मोर ऐतो शोक अच्छे ऐतो शाद अच्छे प्राण हुए अच्छे बो I will pour out the waters of love. I will break through the caverns of stone. My life will I pour on this earth, and the song of my life will I sing. Ki jali ki hulo aji? Jagiya uthi lo pran. Dur hote shuni jano, Moha Shagurir gaan. Bang 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 kara, aaj ke aaj kar. Our final presentation is another very popular song composed by Tagore in April 1914. The story goes that Tagore had told the renowned artist Ashit Kumar Haldar, grandson of Tagore's elder sister Sharut Kumari Devi, that he was looking for an image of Sharashati. Saraswati, goddess of wisdom, music, and the arts. The passion with which Tagore had elaborated his vision resulted in Ashit Kumar Haldar painting a flaming image of Saraswati, which was unveiled in front of Rabindranath. It immediately created a deep impact on the poet, who started singing in a low, subdued voice, and a new song was composed. My heart is on fire with the flame of thy songs. It spreads and knows no bounds. It dances, swinging its arms in the sky, burning up all that is dead and decayed. Silent stars gaze on it in awe from across the darkness, and the wanton winds come rushing upon it from all sides. Oh, this fire! Like a golden lotus, unfolds its petals in the heart of the night. To me, Jesu, we are going to be a good ए आगुन छोड़िए गलो, ए आगुन छोड़िए गलो, सब खाने, सब खाने, सब खाने, तुम जे शुरे रागुन लगे दिले मोर पाने, ए आगुन छोड़िए गलो, ए आगुन छोड़िए गलो, सब खाने, सब खाने, सब खाने, तुम जे शुरे रागुन लगे दिले मोर पाने जो तो सब मोरा गाचे डाले डाले नाचे आगुन रे जो तो सब मोरा गाचे डाले डाले नाचे आगुन रे आकाशे हाथ तुले शे कार पानी कार पानी कार पानी तुम ही जे शुरे रागुन लगे दिले मोर पानी आधारे तारा जग आवा पुरे रोचे वो था कार पागल हवा बाई
That concludes our presentation, Bishwara Pran, the first digital presentation compiled and produced by the Tagoreans UK. The format and concept have been guided by Helen Keller's famous statement, Alone we can do so little, together we can do so much. We do hope that our humble collective team endeavor has helped us reach out, connect with and inspire all of you across the world as we all seek to react, respond, recover and rebuild ourselves from the shockwaves emanating from this deadly pandemic. We conclude with a collage of photographs showcasing some of our most memorable milestones over the last 55 years in the company of some of the leading exponents of Tagore music and culture and with some of our key patrons, members, friends and well-wishers who have been an integral part of our creative journey. The soundtrack to this piece is an extract from Rag Bihag played on the sitar by Imrat Khan also at the commemorative 1986 Tagore Festival organized across the UK by the Tagoreans. Stay safe, stay brave and stay resilient and let us take this opportunity to pause and appreciate the world full of vibrant life. Vishwabhara Pran. Thank you.